the Breakpoint Project, teaching you the footwork to get in and out of the top of each specific route. Drop pop, this is one of two ways to get in and out of a hitch or a short stopping route underneath 10 yards. You can see it used here on a whip route by Keenan Allen. Drop in the direction you want to go, then a violent pop step. Other way to get out of these types of routes, these short stopping routes, is a trigger step on your outside foot. Slam that outside foot in the ground, a hard trigger step to stop yourself. All right, now the extension of that trigger step is the false accelerate, when you're going to take three violent steps now, snap one, two, and come running out of the break. All right, the tight break now, this is often used on deeper curls and comebacks. You're adding a step from the false accelerate. This is four steps, drop one, two, three. You're going to drop in the direction you want to go, take three choppy steps and run out. All right, dropping your hips to the ground, your body language, your violence, your intention at the top is still extremely important. Okay, it's not a huge deal adding an extra step. Your, your hips dropping to the ground and your body language is the most important thing on false accelerates and tight breaks. All right, now here's a square break. This is used for short in and out cuts, okay? Again, drop in the direction you wanna go, drop break line. Now a speed cut. These are for timing in and out cuts where you're breaking off a one step pressure step without losing any speed and you're running through the cut. Break drive line to round the corner, keep those arms pumping and make sure you accelerate through the cut. Don't get too hung up on am I taking three steps or four steps in the very beginning. Just focus on your pad level, just focus on your hip drop, and focus on violent feet running in and out of the brakes. Your, your footwork will catch up as you get more and more reps. That's all I got, fellas. Hope you enjoy. Coach Leaf signing out. Peace. From the sidelines, we gotta hustle because we gotta eat.